like most people, you may have a few dust bunnies built up around the house this time of year. So a dust bunny, that's that fuzzy dust buildup. You can find it in the cracks, the crevices, or the corners of your home. And I have before us what oh, may be the man. world's Look largest Doc, dust bunny. Look Doc, at that thing. This is more like a dust elephant, though. <laughs> this, this is, is, is huge. Huge. You know where this came from? That is just wrong. This came from our offices. Oh. <laughs> Stop it. Yes, and the reason oh I'm putting God. gloves on is in a little while you may learn that dust bunnies can actually have some toxins in it. That's not a bees yeah, The number right? one thing, though, <laughs> what do you think the number one thing in this dust bunny is? Shout them out. Skin. Someone over here said skin. Number one thing in here, human cells, okay? Ooh. It's you. Every human, and this is what's crazy. I've got a prop to make this more realistic. Every week, 28 grams of skin cells we shed. So this much. That adds up over time. Mm. When's the last time you vacuumed or dusted? Yeah, if, it's, if it's been a few weeks and you have five members of your household, that gets pretty, <laughs> pretty <laughs> profound pretty quickly. <laughs> So one of the things I want to show you all is, I bet you there's some dandruff in there too. Well, I'm putting on a mask just because dust does tend to unsettle. So when I when I grab this, I can see some big things. I don't know if you can. You know, there, here's a tag. Here's some plastic. I think that's a potato chip. A lot of hair. Ugh. Do you guys want to know what's really in this? No. I'm gonna I'm going to show you all. And dust <laughs> dust is everywhere. It's all around us, and I'm going to show you what this dust bunny is made of beyond just human skin cells. Hair. That's something I see quite a bit of in our mega dust bunny. Mites, dust mites, as well as their droppings and waste. This is um, mold, mold spores. Very common allergen producer. Food bits. I mentioned potato chips in our, our big bunny there. It's probably in your home, too. These are viral particles. How nasty is that? Bugs. Lots of dead bugs found in the dust bunny. Pollen. We all know come springtime, pollen can be all over the house. And this is what I want to focus on a little bit today is things like pesticides, other toxins, even flame retardants can build up in your house over the winter. And a lot of times we don't realize it because we're not getting fresh air. And as these things, things build up, they can be a danger to our health. Well, you know, after a long winter, the air inside your house can be 10 times more toxic than the air outside. That's why spring cleaning is so important.